Okay. Uh, I'm Paige Marzinczyk, and I'm going to be running across Haiti, and this is my mom, Amanda Marzinczyk, and she'll be a part of the support crew. I'm running to raise funds for Team Tassie. All the fundraising will go directly to the work they do, helping find education, healthcare, and to create more jobs for Haitians. Um, I met Team Tassie on my second trip in Haiti. Um, last year, my mom actually saw them training for their run across Haiti last year, and then when they were looking for runners this year, we figured what better way to be able to travel back down to Haiti. So how far is the run? Like how much, how, how big of a run is this? Um, it's 230 miles in eight days, uh, essentially 350 kilometers over those eight days. Well, when my mom goes down to Haiti, she she's a nurse, so she has a lot more that she can do hands-on um, during her week's stay. For me though, I feel like I still have yet to find something where it's a more of a long-term impact. And Team Tassie, their whole thing is accompaniment. Did I say mm -hmm. that right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, where they walk alongside these families. So they're helping them break free from poverty through job creation and sustainable employment. What they have kind of done is if settled in a, a very poor neighborhood outside of Port-au-Prince called Menelas. And it all started, that is where Tassie, who the organization um, started helping, that is where he and his family live. So they are not spreading their resources thin everywhere mm -hmm. they're working in this one community so we have been out to this community Paige and I we've been to the homes we've met some of the families they're helping so we can really see on a ground level what they are doing and you know they start with health care if there's a, a medical issue within the family or the neighborhood they'll address that first education um, access to education and then it's up to asking the families what do you need next you know what is your goal for a job employment you need a driver's license here, we'll help you with that. You know, it, it's just the basics, just to help them get on their feet a little bit. And like I say, we've we've been there, we've met the families. We That is why we're we're getting involved, because I guess we, we've seen, you know, what they're doing. I am training for consistency versus actually running full distances, because one day is 90 kilometers, so I'm obviously not gonna go out and do a 90 kilometer run, but more so back-to-back -back, uh, long distances, um, along with some speed and stuff, but just so my body can handle the volume. So all of the fundraising that is raised um, is actually going towards Team Tassie. Uh, none of the fundraising that I do will go towards my flights, uh, hotels, anything like that. We are, um, that's kind of our, and it always has been, every trip we pay for that ourselves. And so I'm really hoping to reach that fundraising goal because I know that that money is going directly to the families that Team Tassie helps. So for people who have been wanting to donate through cash or check, uh, my email will be below and I'd love to set that up.